Pete, another three points tonight. What's your assessment after that one? Well, if anybody's wondering how we want to play this year, me and Temps, I think you've seen it in abundance tonight. High front foot, aggressive football. Um, want to win the ball back high up the pitch. Set traps for oppositions. Um, and, and then play some free-flowing stuff when we've had it. I think we've moved the ball better than we've moved the ball all season tonight. Um, and, and I think we've put on a real show for the fans tonight. And two goals and two set pieces, is that something you've been working on? Well, I, I want to give some credit here to, to, to Jason Taylor and to, to Lewis Dunwoody who, who do all our set pieces. And that's their, their, their sort of domain. I've given them full uh, reign on set pieces and fair credit to them. that They've done a really good job and long may that continue. And it was a first EFL goal for Tyrell Warren who I thought was outstanding again tonight. Ty's getting better and better by the game. A real investment by the football club to bring Ty here and if he continues to, to keep progressing like that, that then I'm, I'm sure the fans will be happy with him. And uh, the other goal was Sam McCulland. How's he doing? Well, again, Neil Macker's doing great. He's come here for an education. He's certainly had five educations in, uh, of difference uh, since he's been here. And, and again, we want young players who want to learn here. We've got a, a, a real good bunch and a real good mix and the young guns are doing great and they're listening, they're learning and I'm real pleased with them. 3,425 Barrow fans in the Salt Eagle Stadium this evening. Amazing once again. Yeah, amazing. They had the place bouncing. They got right behind the team. And it's all we can ask for. And, and, and we've got to keep delivering for them uh, when they keep turning up. Do we get any knocks tonight? No, I think we're all OK. Again, I think we've got some tired bodies. The way we play, we're going to get uh, bumps, bruises and tired bodies. But we're, we're hopeful of George being back next week. He's been out um, running. So that, that brings another man to the group as well next week, which is great. Um, but apart from that, as far as I'm aware, we're all OK. And finally, we're going to Harrogate on Saturday. What are your thoughts ahead of that one? Well, they've had a great win at Gillingham tonight, so I'm looking forward to watching that game tomorrow. Uh, and tomorrow, the plan starts for Saturday.